Hey everyone, I'm Pubcrawler644 here and I am back with more tips on Conan. Today we're looking at the fish traps. Okay, so on Conan we have uh, two types of trap. We have the fish and we have the shellfish. So to make the fish, you go to feats, survival, you get your primitive cook on, and then it's a third one, fisher. And this lets you lock the fish trap, the shellfish trap, the ugly fish, the fish trophy, and the rare fish. So crafting. To make the fish trap, all you need is a branch and twine. To make the shellfish, you need shaped wood and twine. Okay. Okay, so the fish traps, you can put you put them in a body of water, and these can actually go in your large well. And what you'll see is they start collecting fish so fish first okay we get different types of fish we get the exotic fish the savory fish and the unappetizing fish okay so what do they do well fish is a food so you can eat it but it also has another resource it will either allow you to get oil or echo but not all oil and <laughs> not all fish will do this so if we come to the campfire now what we can see here, unappetizing fish, if I put one of these in, this will cook one cooked fish but it will also give me echo so it's a good res good, or oh, echo, I put in the comments how you pronounce it, but it gives you one for pay fish, okay, so if I put nine in just for example, I'm going to get, uh, I should have ten in total now, I should, yeah, ten cooked fish, ten echo. The savoury fish, if I put one in, it just cooks it, it doesn't give me anything. So if I put five in. Nope, just cooks it. Okay. Yeah, the big guy. The exotic fish. Put one in, let's see what happens. He just cooks it. I put ten in. Okay, so these are a good resource for food, but these don't give us much else. Now the Unappetizing fish, which isn't a great for food, that will give you echo. So one fish per echo. The next thing is oil. Do they give us oil? Do are all fish created equal? So we have the unappetizing fish. I'll throw one in. And it just gives me one oil. Okay, if I put ten in. So I'll put five in. As you can see, one oil per fish. Savoury fish, do they give us oil? So if we put one in, nothing happens. But if we bump it up to five, so it's two savoury fish per one oil. Now that is probably because of my settings. So I believe it should be five fish for one oil, but you want to check that on your save. And then we have the exotic fish. So if we put one in, Nothing happens. I bump that up to two. Nothing happens. All right, let's make it four. Let's put five in. So I think you can see from there, five fish makes one oil. Okay. Now, on the wiki it says ten fish for oil, so you can probably guess what, what's happening there. So we have three types of fish, unappetizing, savory and exotic so we know that the unappetizing can give us oil and it can give us echo on a pretty much one-to-one -one ratio uh, we can get oil off the other two but we need to use more fish so if i just want oil what do i need so if you go to the fish trap and i'll just empty them um, all the insects that you've collected and you've thought what is the point to them let's put half of them in they start bumping up the speed for the fish. So if you just want to like concentrate early on on the unappetizing fish for your echo or your oil, you've probably got tons of insects gathered about from collecting it all. Don't throw them away, throw them in your fish tanks. Okay. The exotic, the big long one, one of those will give you a 10% chance of creating a greater bear. Um, in the animal team so you know you might want to run your odds okay so I want to get 
more of the exotic. What do I need? Well, the other thing you've seen is the grubs, which now I can't find. The little fat chubs here they are. Okay. So if you put a grub in, you start just getting the exotic fish straight away. So it's nice and handy. So if you want to like start targeting them for your bears, or you just want to get some, that's what you need to do for that. And it's just better food and stuff. Okay, so that's the fish out the way. So the second thing we need to look at when we're messing around here is the shellfish. So we have three types, the exotic, the savory, and the own appetizer. And it's pretty much the same. Right, so let me just take all of them. So while I'm here, do the grubs give us anything? So the grubs immediately start doing the exotic. I don't know what happened there. <laughs> let me pull that back. Yeah, see, so it, grubs will start getting as exotic and the insects will start getting as the unappetizing fish, shellfish. So, what do these do? Okay, so at the cooker, let me just put shellfish in here, it's easier. Alright, so the unappetizing, we throw one in, cook it. Oh. We get one shellfish, one echo. Okay, same as the other thing. The exotic, if we put one in, we just get a cooked shellfish. Uh, the other guy, am I going insane? Oh, yeah. So the savory, we put one in. I think it follows the same rules as the fish. Let me just put five of these in here. No. Okay. In the fluid press, if we put one exotic fish in, well, nothing happens in any of them. Okay. Um, the savory shellfish nothing happens but we put the unappetizing one in and nothing happens <laughs> so they're useless for oil but they're a good resource of echo okay so let me just run to my shale back and just see what they take okay so i'm at the shale back so they prefer the exotic shellfish uncooked might as well give her them the unappetizing shellfish and then the savoury shellfish. So it's not fish with these guys, it's the shellfish kind of stuff. Okay, so to recap with the shellfish, you need shaped wood and twine to make one. You get the unappetizing shellfish and that will give you one cooked shellfish, one echo in the campfire. Uh, the savoury and the exotic shellfish will just cook. They won't give you anything extra on that. And none of them give you oil, unfortunately. But if you think of it, it's an excellent way to farm oil because oil is one of the toughest things to get. Echo can be tough to get as well if you are nowhere near spiders. And even then with spiders, it can be a hit and miss about how much you get off them because you're going to get chitin uh, chitting with them as well. So, I would suggest you do a fish farm, um, and then you've got a steady source. And don't forget, you can um, you can just throw it in the oil and eat the um, throw the unappetizing fish in the press, uh, get that for oil and eat the other two, or you can uh, cook it or cook the unappetizing shellfish and get yourself some cooked food and echo for your trouble as well. Hope you found this. Um, little guide helpful uh, leave some comments below um, if you think I've missed anything out or just what you thought of the video and if, if you like me doing this series uh, it's pubcrawler644 thank you for watching bye bye